My name is Jean Pepperell Fanatka. I'm a Kadich woman from Barracuda, the Northern Territory, which is about three hours north of Alice Springs. I love outdoors, I love the territory, I love hiking, camping, astronomy, just me being me. <laughs> yeah, enjoying life. <laughs> So a good friend of mine won it the year before, Russell Thompson. I didn't expect to win it, but I did. And now I'm proud to announce that the recipient of this year's bursary is Jean Pepperell. So I was very humbled about that. <laughs> like this bursary is a really good example where you can give someone the support and opportunity to go remote and hope they have one of those amazing experiences and hopefully one day you know, want to change the face of rural medicine. <laughs> medicine makes you doubt yourself a lot. It makes you think that you're not good enough or we kind of call it imposter syndrome. So winning the award, it made me realise that um, I had been doing okay and making me really excited for the future. Alice Springs is a small community so I've been able to meet so many patients over and over again and I'm just so rewarding when you hear that that patient asks about you and when they go for their follow-up appointments. Um, I just found that so humbling and I think it's those kind of experiences that make you realise that what you're doing is the right thing. I love the fact that no matter where you are in town you can see the ranges, it doesn't take long to suddenly be out of phone reception and just be in the middle of nowhere surrounded by, you know, ancient rock formations and beautiful birds and freezing cold water holes. Um, and then if you're out there at night and just seeing a blanket of stars, like, there is nothing better for the soul than getting out in nature. Hopefully being a doctor, I can be a good advocate for improving Aboriginal health as well and start to make some changes. There is definitely a deficit in terms of healthcare in remote areas and, and I think it's because people don't want to go remote but the people who live in those remote areas deserve good quality healthcare just like anyone in the city. So we do need to create these opportunities so people want to go remote in the future and hopefully stay remote and help shape these communities and shape people and their lives. And I just want to be part of that community and continue to serve my community and provide quality healthcare to people in remote Australia. I just want to use that and continue to do what I do every single day and enjoy what I do every single day.